Hi, my name is Antti Suvanto. I come from Efficode and uh, I'm going to go through a couple of reasons what is needed that a customer will buy your product. Firstly, there needs to be some kind of uh, problem or need. The customer needs to have a job to be done, desire or whatsoever, but kind of a reason to buy your product. And, and definitely if you are de developing products and, and there is no real needs for that, most likely it will be very difficult to sell. Secondly, you, you will need offering, you need the product. So if there is a need, your product needs to be somehow in sufficient level to satisfy that need and, and the offering need, needs to contain all the necessarily, necessary levers and functionalities, user interfaces whatsoever that it can really solve the problem or need you, you are doing for your customer. Thirdly, we need the encounter. So kind of a time, maybe a physical place where your offering and the customer uh, need a meeting, preferable in the same time, so that the customer can find your products. And also when the need is urgent, you are there, your product or solution is, is available for him or her. And fourth point, it's not enough that there is a need, there is product offering, there is this encounter. But you need to have some kind of uh, trigger, something you push the customer with in order to make the transaction or purchase. So giving a specific reason why the customer should buy right now and uh, not waiting for month or six months or one year to go forward. Kind of uh, pushing the customer over the limit. So that's a good start. So customer need, customer problem, customer job to be done to be solved with your product or product offering, encounter your offering and the customer needs to be somehow meet in time and place. And the finishing touch is the trigger, how you push the customer over limit and uh, make him buy your product. Thank you.